Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be all about these millions of things hanging off my head. I have had so many questions about my hair and what my hair care routine is and how I get it to be this colour. So I am finally filming the video to tell you all. I don't even know where to start. Okay, so first off, I'm going to start with how I actually got my hair this colour. I, about two years ago now, um, decided that I wanted blonde hair because I had wanted blonde hair for my whole entire life. It was like a dream of mine, but I always thought my hair was too dark. And then one day I was like, screw it, I'm going to try to get to blonde. So I slowly made the process up to blonde, getting to blonde, went through a gross orange stage, everything. I always went to the hairdressers um, and they dyed it for me and yeah, slowly went through a blonde stage and then I got to a white. And then from the white, it just slowly went to more of an ashy silver colour. And then um, when I was in America, in New York, if you've seen my vlogs and stuff, I randomly dyed my hair silver. And then from that point, I was like, I freaking love silver hair. I need it. But my hair just got so unhealthy um, from bleaching it all the time. So I just got my um, roots faded out. So this is my natural colour at the top and my dyed at the bottom. And... Um, yeah, so that's pretty much my hair journey and my little bit of my backstory on what my hair's been through. And so when I originally had blonde hair, I mean, was starting to go blonde, sorry, I had hair like all the way down to like my belly button. I had really long hair. So if any of you are thinking about going this grey silver colour or whatever, just keep in mind that you're probably not going to have long hair and I haven't been able to grow my hair really any much longer than this since. No matter how well you take care of it, it's just dead. Although maybe now with um, all of the Curaplex and Olaplex and all that stuff that's coming out, that's probably going to help your hair a lot. I did recently start using that, but um, yeah, I was really bad at keeping that up, so it probably didn't work that well on me. <laughs> Anyways, let's get into all the actual products that I use. So first off, I'm going to show you the hair dye, which is the um, Pravana Chroma Silk Vivids. And I use the colour Silver. This um, product is actually really hard to get in Australia. I have to get it shipped um, from overseas and it does end up being quite pricey. But I totally think it's worth it. Every time I use it, my hair feels like so nice and soft. And it's amazing and I love the colour that it gives. It's just like the best product I've ever come across. And it will give you that beautiful silver colour. But you do have to start off with a um, really white base that like you you pretty much need white hair <laughs> before um, it will work on you. So next up, moving into when I am actually washing my hair. The shampoo I use is the Kevin Murphy Blonde Angel Wash. And this is a purple shampoo, so it is made for blonde slash silver hair. Um, so yes, I use that one. So first of all, I will shampoo my hair with this and just wash it straight out. And then the next shampoo I will use is um, the L'Oreal Professional um, Silver Gloss Protection System. I don't even know there's so many words in this bottle, I don't really know what it's actually called. <laughs> but anyways, I use this, um, this is another shampoo, so I actually use this more to tone my hair. So I will leave it into my in my hair for about 20 to 30 minutes. Um, and I do that pretty much every time I wash my hair. And that's probably not healthy for it, but I want to maintain that silver, so I just put up with it. Um, yeah, so it is a bit extensive. <laughs> And then moving on to conditioner, I use the Kevin Murphy Blonde Angel, which is the, obviously the one that matches with the Blonde Angel Wash. And then again, that is a purple shampoo. Um, and yeah, so I just use that as a normal conditioner when my hair is feeling a little bit um, soft and I don't feel like I need a deep treatment, which I'm not going to lie, is not very often. So I don't really use that one too much. But um, I obviously bought that one because it came in with the set with the shampoo. Still on the Kevin Murphy um, shampoo and conditioner, I don't really feel like that actually does anything to the colour of your hair. So they are like meant for blonde hair and they are purple, but... When I was only using those two products and not the L'Oreal one, my hair just went straight back to like a 
bleached yellow untoned kind of shade of um, hair and yeah I just was not happy with that so that's why I had to add in the L'Oreal product in there as well and then finally if I am looking for a deep treatment or conditioner or whatever I will use the NKD hair citrus um, mask yeah, so that one's from um, NKD Body Witch, Brittany Lee Saunders on YouTube. Um, she owns that brand and she has heaps of cool things from there. So you should definitely check that one out. I love this and I do pretty much use it almost every time I wash my hair because it makes my hair feel so soft. And because my hair is really dry, I do need that extra treatment every time I wash it. And another thing I'm going to mention with... <laughs> I did um, mention this in one of my previous videos when I was doing the Kim Kardashian braid and it received a lot of um, kind of rude comments <laughs> that I actually only wash my hair once a week and I know to some people that kind of like freaks them out and they're like how do you wash your hair only once a week but for my hair that's what works. I really I don't need to wash it any more often than that. It doesn't smell like it stays normal it doesn't really get greasy um until obviously like the sixth or seventh day which is when i'm actually washing it so my hair can handle being not washed for that long um i i think it just you can train your hair to not wash it as often because it's really not good for your hair to wash it every single day every two or three days is generally what they normally recommend but yeah i guess for me everyone's different i only wash my hair once a week and i really wouldn't wash it any more often than that so yeah I guess that's pretty much all about my hair it is a quite an extensive routine but if you're gonna have that gray silver hair you're gonna have to put up with it like that's just what you're gonna have to do it's not an easy hair color to maintain or have so you've got to be prepared to do that so yes I guess that's pretty much all about my hair I am so happy with it at the moment um, I recently just like cut it a bit shorter than what it was because the ends were just all yuck and gross so I just chopped it off and I really like that kind of a really solid finish especially when it's straight it's just like all BAM across and I'm, it's just so in fashion right now and I just love it so much so yeah I think that's about everything I've got to say for this video if you have any more questions or something like I didn't answer so I have no idea if I even covered everything I don't know just ask me in the comments and I will definitely get back to you um yeah so if you liked this video make sure to give it a thumbs up and um, subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram it's just riley watson um and that's pretty much all i have to say so i love you guys see you later